Can't resist having a little digs. Who, Anna? Oh, you just don't see it. You just think the best of everyone, you. You're too soft. No, I'm not. Please, whenever we watch Jurassic Park, you feel sorry for the dinosaurs. Well, they're only following their instincts. Oh, what did Anna say anyway? Oh, she was just going on about Gary and her next door having some fancy wedding and said we only chose the bistro because it was cheap. Well, it was. Hmm. Yeah, but it's not for her to say, is it? Do you know, I'm not surprised Owen left her the way she carries on. <laughs> That's right. Sophie, I've just remembered I need a little ham bringing the sheets in. Hey, I've got another job on Balaclava Terrace in a bit. It'll only take an hour or so. Will you be ready by then? Well, you want me to look gorgeous, don't you? You're always gorgeous to me, love. Oh, he's a fast learner. I thought you might like to see what we've done with the garden. Yeah, Gary said you spent a lot of time out here. <laughs> well, the chickens obviously need a lot of care. Uh, let me just take this and then I'll uh, introduce you. Hello. Hey. Enough of your snidey comments, please. All I did was see you as a fast learner. You know exactly what I'm talking about. Your little dig about your dad. Oh, that's rich. You just slipped out. Yeah, well, thank God. Tim didn't hear how he might slip out and all. Do you want that? Oh, Mum, you are such a hypocrite. How so? Going on about Anna and how common she is, and but she's not the one who's going around kissing her ex-husband, is she? What has that got to do with anything? Because you slag everyone off. Well, you're not exactly Miss Perfect yourself. Well, I apologise that I don't have your saint like qualities, Sophie, and I shall try and be more generous with my opinions in the future. In return, can you please keep your big gob shot about me kissing your dad? Nice evening together. <laughs>